so nervous. I really hope I pass this math exam. I've always sucked at math. You know what? In life, sometimes you just gotta go and accept the fact that you might not do good. Ooh, let's just go enter. Angel, are you ready? No, Tom. Do I look ready to you? I am stressing, okay? Anyways, morning, sir. Today is everyone's favorite day. Let roll, please. It's exam results day. Exam results. Dun, dun, dun. Favorite day? More like our worst day ever. Finally, for once, I agree with Charles Ritchie. This is Charles Ritchie, the most popular and richest guy in our school. Clearly, exam means nothing to him because he's already made it in life. If he wants, he could go and fly out to Italy tomorrow. This is the most meanest girl in our school, Sophia Dior. You wouldn't want to mess with her because her parents own big makeup brands. Oh, and all she does is just apply makeup and gossip. Behind her is my friend Tom Little. He always knows the answers to every question. Oh, and although he is really nice, he does become a bit annoying when he always constantly reminds the teacher about homework. Then next to him is Angelica. She's a cool girl in the school that everyone is friends with. And then there's me, the girl that's stressing over her math exam. Tom Little, come first to view your exam results. Good luck, Tom. I really hope you do good. I mean, you would obviously do good. You have been getting A's your whole entire life. First rank. Not in the school, but the entire world. Yippee! Oh my god, well done, Tom. I'm so proud of you. You came first in the entire world? Yeah, I've never seen Tom this happy before. Wow. As if we didn't know he would come first. Charles Ritchie. Yeah, we already know he's going to pause because daddy's money. Second in the school. Congrats. Charles Ritchie never studies. How did he get second in the school? Second, not first. Are you serious? Come, I need a word with you. Tell your dad to give me the bribe cash tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. I will tell my dad to transfer the $10,000 tomorrow. Oh my god, I think I'm up next. I'm so scared. I've studied a lot for this exam, so I really, really hope I do good. Angel, very disappointed. Uh, that does not sound too good, does it? Please be good, please be good. I mean, he might be disappointed that I got a B or a C or something. Oh my god. I got a big fat F? No, 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 that's not possible. Sorry, it can't be. Let's see what she got. No, 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 please don't come check. Maybe if you didn't spend so much time playing Roblox. But no, no, I did study. I tried so hard. Why is everyone coming and checking my marks? Oh my God, this is so embarrassing. How did I get an F? But I studied so much and I thought I did pretty decent with the exam. How is this possible? Oh, wow very bad angel no 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 this is humiliation this is violation everyone's just laughing at me so sir are you sure uh, you might have mistaken me for someone else are you sure everyone passed except you no no oh poor little girl <laughs> even i passed this is so embarrassing i gotta go i gotta go i can't believe i failed for the first time ever i failed an exam and i didn't even think i would fail tom can you believe this um angel Angel, it's, um, it's okay. No, Tom, it's not okay. You know I need math for my future job. I want to become a detective. Um, maybe I can help you study. It's, uh, not the end of the world if you fail. Um, I guess you can try harder next year. Tom, thanks, but, but it's not gonna help me. There is no way. I'm pretty sure I haven't failed. Someone has definitely done something. I'm looking for her paper. I can't find it, Sophia. Aha! Uh -huh. I found it, Charles. Perfect. Now let's change her grade. From an A to a big fat F. All done. I changed it on the paper. You should now log in and change it on the schooling system, Charles. Got it. Okay, Tom, it's gonna go home. I have a big headache. My parents are going to be so disappointed. <sighs> this has to be like the worst day of my whole entire life. I still cannot believe I failed maths. I didn't even get a C or a D. I got an F. Oh, I just want to go and sleep now. Huh? What was that noise? Ah! What was that? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What was that? What's going on? Who was that outside of my room? Can my day get any more worse? I need to go and see what that was. Uh, and I'm also home alone, so it doesn't even help. Um. Oh, my God. Ah! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. She didn't even realize that it was me, Charles. Charles Ritchie. Well done, Charles. Let's go before she sees us.
Oh my god. Who was that? And what did they want? <gasps> the doorbell. Is it them again? Oh no. You know what? If I continue hiding under my blankets, I would never find out who it was. I need to toughen up. Let me just take my torch out. Uh, let's just go check who it is. I'm coming. What do you want? Oh, Tom? Tom, what are you doing? It's like 2 a.m. Were you the one that was pulling this silly prank on me? I can't believe you. Why would you do that, Tom? Um, what prank? I'm here to console you because you did pretty bad in the exam. Wait, so you weren't the one that was dressed up as a ghost and scaring me outside of my room? Um, why would I do that? Who did that? Uh, I guess never mind. Just come inside. So what's up, Tom? What do you want to say? Um, well, actually, yesterday night i was thinking very very hard and i've come to a conclusion that someone is pulling a very very bad prank on you because me and you studied a lot in the library so there's no way you would fail i'm still in a state of shock i don't think i truly don't believe i failed and tom i think you might be right someone might be pulling a prank on me because just a few minutes ago i had people dressed up in a ghost outfit scaring me outside of my room and those not one of them there was two of them uh, anyways tom there's not much i can do about it who would possibly hate me that much that they would change my grade or scare me tom it's getting late you should get it going and i'm gonna go sleep now <sighs> Charles, Richie, I think it's time for a final step. Are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Ha 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 ha. Now her house will smell like fireworks. Isn't this dangerous? Her house might get on fire. Stop, Sophia, stop. Relax, it won't get on fire. I'm going to save her. I need to save her. Sophia, move. Stop, Charles. It's not that big of a deal. Let's go before we get caught. Oh my god, the police. something burning do i have the oven on again oh my god oh my god my house is on fire my house the doors are locked it's not budging oh no oh no what do i do <coughs> mom dad <coughs> where do i go the doors are budged tom guys the door is budged charles tom uh how do i open the door oh no oh no i think this is the time where i die stay back guys i can handle this it worked! It worked! <sighs> I need fresh air. Girl, are you okay? Uh, yeah. If it wasn't for you guys, I think I wouldn't have been okay. I'm still in a state of shock. Here, have some water. Oh, thank you. I needed this. <sighs> Thank you guys so much. I don't know what I can do to pay you guys back. This has been my family at home for the past 17 years of my whole entire life. You guys don't know what this means to me. I can't believe I almost lost in my Brookhaven home. Why is she thanking me? Oh man, I feel so bad now. Her house, her family house, that she has lived in for her entire life, almost got burned down because of me and my stupid friend Sophia. Oh man, what have I done? Why am I so cruel for? This is all my fault. I shouldn't have let Sophia burn her house down. Oh man, I am so stupid. Fireworks obviously can cause fire. What was I thinking? Thank you guys, thank you guys. Um, I told you someone has been pulling a prank on you. It's kind of getting out of hand and dangerous now. It's not safe for you anymore, Angel. Yeah, I guess you are right. Ever since I've woken up, I have gotten an F. And then someone has been dressing up as scary clowns and ghosts to scare me. And now this? My house almost got caught on fire? I'm definitely not that unlucky to be experiencing this. Yeah, girl. If I was you, I would move out. Yeah, I think you guys are right. I need to leave Brookhaven. Move out? No. Um... I mean, why would she? I'm sure whoever is doing this will stop this. No, Charles, you don't understand. My life is in danger. Someone is following me and putting a trap on me. If I don't move out now, then who knows? Maybe tomorrow they will hunt me down. Oh, uh, Sophia, what are you doing here this late? Yeah, girl, if I was you, I would totally move out. It's dangerous for you. In fact, I have your bags and ticket ready. Angel, no, don't go. All right, I'll start packing tomorrow. I mean, you should really stay here. No, Charles, you don't understand. Thanks, guys, for being amazing friends. But I gotta leave Brookhaven. Okay, and I think everything is good. We are ready to go now. I can't believe I'm leaving my hometown Brookhaven for once and all. Bye, guys. Bye. Uh, 
hope we never see you. <sighs> I need to leave before things get worse. This was all me. I need to stop her right now. All right, guys, my bag is all checked and oh, I cannot believe I'm about to do this. Tom? Tom, what are you doing here? Um, Angel, if you're going to leave, so am I. And Charles? Charles, what are you guys doing here? If you're going to leave, then so am I. But why? Why are you guys following me? After all, this was my stupid plan. What? So you are telling me you are behind all of this? You are the one that changed my marks? You were the one that scared me in my room? And you were the one that almost burned my house? down? Yes, it was all me. I'm so sorry. I really hope you can forgive me, Angel. What? Charles! I knew you were bad, but I didn't think you were that bad. I'm so sorry, Angel. No, this can't be. You are so evil, Charles. You almost burned my family house down. Imagine what my parents would have gone through. I got influenced by Sophia, but I blame myself. I'm leaving. Don't ever talk to me again. So if anyone has to leave, then it has to be me. Okay, then leave. You stay behind. Yes, I can't believe you did that. I can't believe you'd be that bad. You can leave now, Charles. You are the threat to my life. Bye. I'm sorry again. Bye. If you could, please forgive me. Oh, wow. I cannot believe that. I mean, Tom, do you think I made the right choice? Because at the end of the day, it was all Sophia's plan. And although he was a part of it, he did end up saving me. Yeah, I guess you were right. It wasn't his idea. So we should give him a second chance. It's all Sophia's fault. Yeah, it's always them. Sophia, how dare you come up to me after what you have done? Ugh, why would he even leave? Leave. I'm stopping him. Well, I guess Charles is not going to leave because Sophia is somehow going to convince him to return back. Let's just go now. At least now I know I didn't fail my maths exam. <laughs> Yay. They really thought I was leaving. Huh. I'm just going to Paris for my one-week vacation. Silly girl.